Thank you for joining me. This is A Touch of Tarot. My name is Genevieve, and I'm going to be doing a reading for Aries. I do just want to mention I have a Patreon account if you have an interest in checking out extended when I do do them. Will there be an extended here? Yes. So you can always check that out on Patreon. Let's get right into this and see what's coming up. I'm going to pull three oracle cards and then I'll get into the tarot. And I also want to pull from here and let's see what's going to come up with that. Okay. So the first card we have is express your love. And I'm asking when will this love be coming in? So let's see how this will relate to express your love. What I am getting is if there's someone you have interest in or feel, you know, drawn to, you may want to express your love to this person. I mean, if you haven't already, and they don't know that you're in love with them, or interested at least, you may want to do that. Here and. Okay. And the three of scrolls, energy. So the first card is the world, and this is psyche. So even if you are a female, it is saying, you know, kind of be aggressive. If you feel someone's watching you and you guys haven't spoke yet, um, it's time to turn a new chapter in your life. It's time to be the one to go for what you want. I feel like there may be someone who's recently got out of a relationship. It doesn't have to be so recently, um, but I feel like the person that will be coming in is someone that's actually taken charge of their life and made a very important decision. Um, this person is looking for union. This person is looking for unity. This person actually does want to be in a beautiful partnership with no secrets, nothing hidden. So this person literally may have been watching you. When is this love coming in? Because you're starting with the world card. And for me, the world card means this year. So this person will be coming in this year. You may have actually met them already and they're just watching you. You may kind of have no idea that this person is interested in you. And you also may be focused on your past right now. So what's needed here is this turnaround, is this new chapter, as I mentioned. Um, this person, you also could have met them in March, or you could be meeting them in about 30 days if you feel like, I haven't met this person yet. Um, so let's see what else. This person may be someone who is very charitable. Like I'm getting the cleanup person or someone who cleans up messes or helps people organize after chaos. So take that as that works for you. This could be a very worldly person, right? Um, let's see what else the other cards are saying. Forgiveness and time. So I feel like the person that's coming into your life really is coming out of a situation that they still need healing from. I feel like um, though aggressiveness is something that can benefit this situation, this person may need time to think about the offer or whatever the energy exchange is. Because obviously I'm saying like express your interest in this person, but I feel like this person is going to need time. Um, especially if you come off very strong, I do feel like, you know, this person is a bit in a shell. This could be a water sign, but I feel the fact that it's telling you to express yourself is that you got to get this person out of their shell. You got to get this person to realize there's nothing to be afraid of. I'm also getting this person does not like competition for whatever reason, Okay, this person does not like competition. This person may be an outdoors person as well. And like I said, they could be well known. Um, 
it's an energy here with the world. But with the forgiveness, this person probably still has some healing, which is why they are so standoffish when it comes to making, you know, coming forward, speaking how they feel, um, making the effort to express their love. They're like, whoa, I can't do that. No way. So that is interesting. Okay. Let's see what else we get for you Aries. When love is coming in. So this is something that is going to be happening. Um, this communication, at least within, I'm going to say the next month. So like the next 30 days, I feel like this is going to literally um, be kind of pushed upon the situation. Like you won't be able, for example, to walk through the doorway until you move the treasure, treasure chest here in the way, right? So it's something like that, like where this person is not going to be able to avoid you. Um, I feel like this person, you know, they're somewhere near you because they are definitely watching you. Uh, this can be, this can have something to do with outdoors, where you may bump into this person. I feel like it's not going to be stoppable. So there is going to be a time when you and this person have to meet. It is a destined energy here. You have to bump into each other. You have to open Pandora's box one way or another. And it looks like the universe is going to help you do that by literally putting a blockage so that, you know, maybe you're going to have to ask this person to help you. Maybe they're going to help you open the door um, next time you see them or something like that. But there is going to be an opportunity when you can finally speak up and express yourself. And because you have this info about the near future that's going to happen, you know now to do so. Um, I understand we're conditioned to think the masculine energy has to come forward, but I feel here you're not really paying attention to this person watching you. But once you realize that there is a connection, it's really important to not lose that opportunity to speak up and just even say, hey, oh, like, you know, I've seen you before or I've noticed you. Who are you? Type of an energy, right? Um, and being very gentle with this person is important. But I also feel this this message, I have to tell you that like this person needs to get out of their shell. So it's not so much about gentle that's important. It's real. Being real is important for this situation. Okay, Aries. So this is what's coming towards you. Um, I like the fact that you just got a very simple answer with time to give things time after you express your love is what I am receiving with that message. Let's look at the beautiful picture. Yeah, once again, we have the exact, it's because, you know, what's going to happen here is this. When you express that, oh, yeah, like, hi, who are you? How are you? I've noticed you. Um, this person is going to have to sit back and watch, you know? And this person is already watching you, but once you express yourself, they're going to be watching you with a different mind frame, with a bit about like, oh, my heart, I feel something in my heart. I wonder, you know, what is this special person here? Some of you may actually be quite well known, um, so that could be why you have this worldly energy to you, but anyhow, I mean, it's looking great to me. I hope that the camera is okay. It's looking great to me. And the one thing I can tell you when this love is coming in, it's this year. Um, it can be within 30 days that you meet this person, but we already have the time card. So give it time. But I do feel this year, Aries, you are going to have a very special love come into your life. And that's absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to get a couple more details in the extended for you, Aries. If you decide to leave us here, this is okay. I mean, your message is beautiful. Bye for now. Okay. 
So Aries, what a beautiful reading. Thank you so much. If you're here, you're on my Patreon. You're greatly appreciated and you know it. Thank you. Bye for now.